welcome to our luxury home channel. My name is Mike and today we're in Reunion, Florida, which is really close to all the Orlando area attractions. I'm going to show you this beautiful home behind me that is listed by Alice. So Alice, tell us a little bit about Reunion. Thank you, Mike. My pleasure. My name is Alice Ann Jackson. I'm with Corcoran Premier Realty. Welcome to Reunion, Florida's central luxury community. We have three championship golf courses here, Nicholas, Palmer and Watson. And the fun doesn't end there. We've got water parks, lazy rivers, crazy golf, tennis, volleyball. There is an endless supply of things to do. In Reunion, we have uh, people who live here all year round. People just use it as investment properties and also a second home and vacation people. Yep. So welcome to Reunion. Awesome, I would love to own this one behind us. This is amazing, it's got a casino. It's called the Casino Mansion too, right? Yes, it yeah, is. so thank you, Alice, for telling us a little bit about Reunion. So the home behind us is a 11 bedroom, 11 full bath, three half bath home with 11,027 square feet of living. And it is listed for $5,798,000. Now, if you are watching this and are thinking about buying or selling any real estate, in Florida, Georgia, or Tennessee, make sure you give us a call at the number below and we'll get you in touch with an expert like Alice who can help you with your home purchase or sale. So let's talk a little bit about the outside of the home. As we come, we see that we have this beautiful paved driveway, it comes up to a three car garage. Now, this is a vacation rental, so the three car garage is used as a casino and arcade. We'll show you that when we go inside. We have these beautiful carriage lights over by the garage. And as I look up, I love the decor of the outside of the house with the blacks and white, the black garage door with the right stucco and then as I look up we have black brickwork going all the way up to the roof line which is Spanish tile roof as we come over towards the entranceway we see that it's very grand it is extremely tall if I go over here and Stan you'll probably get a good idea of how tall this entryway is we have the beautiful black brickwork going all the way up over the archways and then as I look on the other side we do have windows that are also arched on that side as well where the stairway is and also the bedrooms now as I come up I step up onto the front entryway this is all covered we have a couple carriage lights on either side that match the garage carriage lights and of course we have a double door with this beautiful metal work going all the way through the door and above it we also have another, another nice huge picture window with the arch on it as well so let's go ahead and go inside and check out this home all right, so welcome into this home. So before I take you on a tour of the home, I do want to mention one thing. Alice, who's the listing agent, also did all the interior design work on this home. I think she did an amazing job. I hope you all agree with me on that. So as we come in, the first thing that we notice are these porcelain tiles. They're beautiful tiles. They go throughout the first floor and also on the second floor, we have the same tile. Over to my right is a nice accent wall with wallpaper done in some nice navy blue colors with the silver inserts going all the way through as well. A couple light fixtures going up that do a really good touch and as I look up that wallpaper goes all the way up to these really really high ceilings with the chandelier hanging above us that chandelier matches the three chandeliers that are hanging over the stairway as well so done a really really good job you'll notice a lot of the blues and silvers and grays throughout the home so as we go we'll go ahead and show you why this is called the casino mansion one of the few different areas where we have casino machines as we step into this room we'll see the first thing that sort of stands out are these slot machines they're state-of-the-art slot machines with digital displays I think they all look really really cool you can sit here and play arcade but this is not the only slot machines there are others upstairs as well not only do we have the slot machines the other thing that's really cool are the carpets the carpets are all these cool multiple colors gives it that really cool bright look makes you feel like you're in las vegas and then as i look at the walls they've done in black with these really cool card designs and also the jackpot sign above us as well we come over to this area we have a bar area now this home is about 99 percent complete they have some finishing touches they do have a couple of shelves they want to put here and you'll see maybe a couple of little tiny finishing touches they need to do as we take the tour of the house but we do have a bar area that's red and gray that matches the uh, accent wall behind it as well and as i look on the other wall we have all these really cool uh, poker chips and really big size on the wall as well. So let's go ahead and show you the rest of the home. So as Haley backs up towards the front door, you'll get a view of what you'll see when you come into the home, which is going to be the family room, which is large. It goes all the way out to the sliding glass doors, the outdoor living, also the pool. You'll even see the sixth hole of the Jack Nicholas golf course behind this home. So follow me this direction. Let's talk about the family room. So the family room is large. It goes all the way 
through the whole home. We have the same sort of color schemes that we see throughout the home. This side of it has the gray couches, matches the gray cabinets that we see on the accent wall. The porcelain tile is lit by LEDs on either side with a TV in the middle and the grays go all the way up to the ceiling. The ceiling itself, our coffer ceilings, they have the, the crown molding and also the grays in the coffer does that really nice touch. Now, as you come over to this side of the family room, we'll notice that we have pretty much a duplicate of the other side, but the only difference is that we have blue couches here instead of gray couches. Everything matches really good. We even have a couple of fans on either side as well. So follow me this direction. Let's go ahead and show you a couple of the bedrooms because we've got so many bedrooms to show you. We're gonna go ahead and go left and show you one of the spare bedrooms first. So this, this is spare bedroom is large. This one is handicapped accessible because this is on a rental program. Now, if you're interested in renting this for a family reunion or a corporate retreat, we'll have a link below that tells you where you can go and rent it and look at all the rates. So we'll have that available for you. But we have a king size bed couple and tables on your side, windows for natural light. And of course, this accent wall, we have a closet that also has some really nice built-ins. And then as we go over to this other side, we see we have a bathroom. This is handicapped accessible with a toilet with a handlebar, but was really neat. I like this the cabinet design, really rich, dark wood colors. It's a lot of service counter. I like the floating sink over the cabinet. And of course the faucet comes off the, the counter as well and the built-in shelves. So let's go ahead and the next stop would be the primary bedroom, which is right across the hallway. So as we come across, we go from ceramic to porcelain back to ceramic tile and we come into the largest bedroom, the primary bedroom suite here in this home. Of course, the king size bed, couple end tables with the windows, and then above us is a tray ceiling, really high ceilings as well with the crown molding. I like the little painted touch around the trays that sort of make the room pop. Right above, or behind me is the uh, French doors going out to the patio and also pool area, so you have that quick access from the primary bedroom suite. And of course, we have our primary bathroom. So as we come into the primary bathroom, the first thing that we're gonna see are these beautiful cabinets in the cream color, solid surface countertops, a couple sink. We have the mirrors that are framed with the light fixtures popping out of the mirror. And then behind me is a shower, which is a large shower. We have a couple shower heads, beautiful accent tile around. And of course, the yellow tile goes all the way up to the ceiling. And then right next to the shower is your tub, surrounded with the tile as well, with a picture window looking out onto the back patio. We have a water closet and also a linen closet as well. As we come over this direction, I'll show you the main closet which is right across the other area. Now remember, this is a secondary home, vacation home, vacation rental. So this is the closet for the primary suite. It is still big enough for that second rental area. So it's designed exactly for what this home is built for. So if you enjoy these tours, make sure you like and subscribe to our channel. We just got over 25,000 subscribers. I want to thank all our viewers, especially those that constantly comment on our videos. We definitely appreciate that. So as we come over here, you'll get a really good view of the kitchen, which is a really grand kitchen. So let me go ahead and turn around and show you everything. It's sort of duplicated. Everything on this side sort of matches everything on that side. So starting off with the counter, we have raised counters currently set up for four people to sit around and so you can sit here and enjoy your morning coffee or breakfast. And that's duplicated right on this side with four seating areas over here as well. So let's go ahead and walk into the kitchen. The first thing that we notice is the center island. The center island has these gray cabinets with the white solid surface countertops. We have a six burner gas stove top with a vent above it. The vent has these really cool white paneling going all the way up to the ceiling. I think that's really, really neat. And then as we walk in, we go ahead and show you what we have on this side. So we have a very same duplicate area right behind the camera as well, but we have our white cabinets and gray countertops, which contrasts great, greatly with the gray counters and the white countertops on this side. We do have our soft clothes, so drawers, so everything's there is good. We have a dishwasher, which also is on the other side. And then we come, we have our sink and faucet, and we also have light fixtures above us as well. So let's continue and go this direction. Now, if you went down here, down the hallway, we come into our casino or our arcade and also our steam room and sauna. We'll show you that later on, but let's go ahead and show you the rest of the kitchen first. We have plenty of extra drawers here. We even have some shelves in the grays where you can put all the cool accent designs and decorative stuff that you want on the shelves. And then we come over into our appliance area. So we have a double Thermador appliance. We also have a refrigerator freezer, which is also doubled on this side as well. So also Thermador, so you have plenty of space for all your cold and frozen goods. In between it is another cabinet, but this one is a little different. You open this up and you get your walk-in pantry. So let's go ahead and go inside and show you the walk-in pantry. So let's come in here. You'll notice everything's sort of stocked. It's on the rental program.
program. So we have glasses and, and cups and plates and everything that you need for your vacation already stocked up in this home. So go ahead and close this. It is also soft closed, so it closes nice and easily. As we continue and we'll go through, we go and look on this side. We have plenty of extra storage over here as well in those grays with that white countertop. And of course the stove above it. And then we have a microwave and we have a duplicate area over here, some more drawers. And of course those same shelves that we saw on the other side. So follow me this direction. You'll get to see the other side of the sink area as well. But we come into our dining room. So the dining room is currently set up for 14 people around a square table. Above it is this really nice light fixture. And of course we have coffer ceilings with crown molding and gray in the paint also in the coffer area. We do have three picture windows looking out on the pool and also the six hole of the Jack Nicklaus golf course. Let's go here. We'll show you another one of the bedrooms as we come through this hallway. We see that we have this really cool tile coming into the bedroom it matches the bedroom design king size bed couple and tables really cool wallpaper going all the way up and of course we do have the tray ceiling with like a dark navy blue paint in between the crown molding and then behind me we do have a door going out to the outdoor living area and then let's go ahead and show you the bathroom which is right down this direction so as we come into the bathroom we do see that we have the cream color cabinets beautiful beautiful counters and of course the, the faucets the mirror which is framed with a couple light fixtures and then on the other side we do have a frameless shower where you can walk in and of course the beautiful tile going along as well and then the rest of the tile goes all the way up to the ceiling with a couple windows for some natural light as you come this direction we just have a water closet and then we do have another closet this one's a nice size closet as we walk in with these really nice custom built-ins as well so let's go ahead and go back over to the other side of the house now if you are a listing agent anywhere in the world and would like us to present your home on our channel make sure you give us a call currently we do florida georgia and tennessee but we're open to go other places as well create partnerships throughout the country and world as we come back through the kitchen we're going to go ahead and show you the arcade area so this is really cool this is probably one of the biggest arcades i've seen in any house so as i walk in here it is just neat everything state of the art so all the equipment whether it's the motorcycles the cars the batmobile the shooting games everything is really neat and of course we have the basketball bowling stuff and for those of you that are nostalgic we do have a pac-man machine and then right above everything this really neat arcade sign that i think is really cool now not only that the interior designer alice did a great job on the walls i love how the walls make you feel like you're in outer space they have friendly aliens all the way around you all with really cool smiles and of course we have some ufos even a shuttle above us and then look at the light fixtures light fixtures are ufo designed as well i think that's really neat i would love to spend time in here whether you're an adult or a kid i think you like it in here so let's go ahead and go down and show you what's down the rest of the hallway so as i come this direction i'm gonna go ahead and go right and down here the first area is the laundry room so this is one of the two laundry rooms we have a washer and dryer so everything you need to get all your stuff done while you're on vacation or uh, while you're renting this or even if you live here and then we come over and we come into the sauna and steam area steam room so we have our sauna to our right and we have our steam room to our left so we can come in here and relax and do everything you need so the only other thing we have down on the first floor is going to be the gym so which is right around the other hallway so follow me this direction we'll come past the family room and we'll come into the hallway so as i come over here i do want to pause here just for one second and talk about how the design the little details so as i come in here we had that archway going all the way over to the gym but what was really nice is how they did the dark navy and then they outlined it with a silver line going across and it does a really good contrast between the dark navy and the white i think that was really good and that silver line continues and we come here to the center it's done in a diamond shape in the actual shape of the wall so that's really neat now over behind me is the elevator this is elevators only for the owner so it's currently locked not available for guests but of course if you purchase this it is available and if you probably need it they might be able to work something out for you uh, but then we come to one of the three half baths we move into the ceramic tile floor we have dark wood cabinets solid surface countertop and of course the mirror the mirror is framed with tile work and of course a light fixture coming out of the mirror then behind me is a shower hexagon tiles on the floor i love those and of course that beautiful tile work goes all the way up to the ceiling and then right next door is a gym as they come into the gym has all the exercise equipment you need it's got the total gym within the gym the elliptical the treadmill the rower the little cycle machine over there 
This is the front of the home with the front arch windows. And of course we have this accent wall. And then on the other side, we do have a mirror as well if you wanna lift weights and look at yourself when you're doing so. So let's go ahead and show you the staircase, which is right here. So the staircase has this beautiful woodworking and of course the metal rails and then the stairs themselves are black with grays. I just love the color combinations throughout this home. So let's go ahead and go upstairs and show you the rest of this home. All right, here we are coming up on the second floor of the home. Before we take you on a tour, I do want to mention these chandeliers. I like how they actually have them lowering as you go down the stairs. Imagine the stairs. We have the big arch window looking out on the front of the house. So as we're here, we have the porcelain tile going throughout the second floor. But let's go ahead and go right. This is one of two themed rooms. Right at the end of the video, we're going to show you the best themed room, which is the Jurassic Park. Can't wait to show you that one. But let's go ahead and go to the Steamboat Mickey room. So as we come here, we have a very spacious area, ceramic tile floors, four beds, a boat popping out of the bunk beds as you see and everything's themed nautically in this room really neat i love all the artwork in this room and then as we go over all the bedrooms of course are en suites this one also is included in that we have our brown cabinets great countertop sink and the mirror that's also framed and of course behind me we have the frameless shower with the tile i love the tile work going all the way up into the decor of the tile going up to the ceiling as well so let's go ahead and go this direction now as i go this direction Haley's going to be right at the top of the stairs so you get to see what you see when you come up here which is the additional casino and all the open space that we have on the second floor but before we go we're going to show you this is the access to the elevator so if you want to take the elevator up it comes out right here very very convenient spot and then the second of the three half bathrooms is here the toilet and then we also have the cabinet I like this cabinet design countertop floating sink above it and of course we do have the framed mirror so let's show you the additional casino space that this home has the casino mansion as we come over here we see our state-of-the-art slot machines let's go ahead and push a button and see what happens are we going to win are we going to win uh nope didn't win that time but you can win we did win earlier so as we come we see that we do have a roulette table in the center also stay the art you can sit on these chairs pick your numbers whether it's black or red whatever number you have the roulette table is in the middle with a bowl that goes around really cool you have your own roulette table right here with all these cool digital displays and of course the led roulette going across the top as well that's really neat now this whole area opens up to an expansive area to the media room and also a secondary kitchen upstairs and what's really nice is of course are the ceilings the ceilings are coffer ceilings all the way throughout with the crown moldings and also gray paint in there and these cool light fixtures that match going all the way through the second floor of this home so as we continue up here on the second floor we do have the jurassic park bedroom over in that direction we'll show you that later on but we do have a dining set here for 15 people to sit and enjoy dining and of course we do have a secondary kitchen we'll show you that in just one second too let's show you the movie theater first so as we come over here this is where i would hang out and watch a movie if you wanted to watch jurassic park this would be perfect so we have elevated seating plenty of space up here to enjoy a movie i love the colors the dark colors with the maroon inserts that we see everything's black now if you wanted to if you purchase this home you can make some easy modifications to this to put a stage up here if you want it to do for business retreats may help with the rentals for you know someone to be up there and then you have this whole open area behind the camera where everyone can listen to whoever's talking on there and you can also have this where it closes in currently it's completely open i sort of like it open in between the different spaces but they do have rails where you can add doors to slide this in to make it a separate little living area or movie theater area so let's go ahead and show you the kitchen so as you come over here to that secondary kitchen beautiful cabinet work and of course we have the granite countertops as we come into the kitchen we have everything that we need for upstairs we have a microwave ice maker sink faucet dishwasher and a full fridge and of course we have all the cabinet work and shelves where you can put all your glasses and wine glasses and even this uh, accent wall it does really well all the colors are done really really well in this house so let's go ahead and show you one of the other larger bedrooms as we come this direction we'll show you this we go into the ceramic tile floors we have a king size bed a couple end tables on either side and of course the windows we even have a window looking out on the golf course on the back of the home and as we go this way we do see that we do have the tray ceilings with wallpaper as well on this room and then we come into the bathroom the bathroom is currently set up with the nice cream uh, cabinets solid surface countertops of course dual sinks mirror with the light fixtures coming out through this door is the water closet and then we do have another main closet back here all these secondary closets are huge especially for vacation rental all the nice custom built-in shelves throughout and then on the other side we do see that we have the shower that is frameless 
with the tile that goes all the way up with the accent tile. And then right next to that, we do see that we have the tub. The tub has a ceramic tile and of course the garden tub in the middle. So let's go ahead and go and show you, I think the other bedrooms first before we go to that Jurassic Park bedroom. That's the best part of this upstairs area. It's got a Jeep in there. Can you believe they have a custom Jeep in the bedroom? But let's go ahead and go right. And if you haven't done already, please like and subscribe both me and Haley, who is my daughter, if you don't know, do appreciate that. Also comment in the comments below. We try to get to all the comments eventually. So let's go ahead. There's three bedrooms down here. So we'll show you these really quick because they're you know, very, compared to the other bedrooms, they're very similar. So let's go ahead and go here. We go from the porcelain tile to really nice plush carpet. So this is bedroom number seven. It's got a king size bed, really cool wallpaper, of course, a couple windows. And all the bedrooms are en suite. So this one also has its own bathroom. We have a tile floor, dark cabinets, and of course, solid surface countertops with the mirror and also frameless shower with tile work going all the way up to the ceiling. So that's bedroom seven, bedroom eight and nine are down here. So let's go ahead and show you bedroom eight first. Also really nice plush carpet as we see. Uh, this one's a queen size bed, couple end table. I love the wallpaper. And then we come over this direction. We go into our own bathroom. Also the dark cabinets, nice, beautiful uh, countertops and the mirror with this frame tile around it. And this one also has a frameless shower with beautiful tile work going all the way up to the ceiling. So let's go ahead and show you bedroom number nine which is right across this hallway. It is so spacious here. They even have a chair where you can sit and uh, hang out here between the bedrooms. So this one also has a king size bed, couple end tables, and you have the window looking out on the front of the house. And of course it has its own bathroom as well, ceramic tile floors. And of course we have the cabinets. This countertop is really interesting. It's like a light shade of green. I do like it. And then we do have the mirror with the ceramic tile around it and the shower, which is frameless. And that same tile work that we saw around the mirror goes all the way up the ceiling as an accent tile as well. So let's go ahead and that's seven, eight, nine. Let's go ahead and do bedroom 10 and 11, which is right across the hallway here in the casino. But before we do that, I'll show you really quickly the upstairs laundry room. So as we come through here, we see we have our washer, dryer, plenty of cabinet space. So you have everything you need to do laundry while you're here, whether it's upstairs or downstairs. And we go through, should we play this machine one more time? Let's see, hold on, hold on. Let's play this and see what happens. Is my, am I lucky now? Nope, I lost another dollar. Oh, well, <laughs> early we, we won like about 50 bucks, didn't we, Haley? So too bad it's not real money. So here we come, let's go ahead and go this way. This is uh, bedroom number 10, very colorful bedroom, couple beds here. So you can fit a few people in here, of course, artwork. And then we do have, this one also has its bathroom right down this hallway, go from that plush carpet, ceramic tile floors, dark cabinets, black countertops, like the countertops, and of course the mirror that's framed with black, light fixture coming out of the mirror, and of course the frameless shower with the accent tiles going all the way up to the ceiling. And then bedroom number 11, other than the Jurassic Park bedroom, now we've seen all the bedrooms. This is bedroom 11. I love the wallpaper here with the triangles, and I like the turquoise in the triangles. Couple windows, couple beds, really cool. And then of course, the bathroom right here. So you come in here, really beautiful tile. Sort of matches the one we have at our house, doesn't it, Haley? And then of course we do have the cabinets, countertop mirror with the framed, and of course the frameless shower with the tile going all the way up with this accent tile of ovals in the center as well. So follow me this direction. Everyone that's lasted this, this long gets to actually see the really cool Jurassic Park bedroom, which I think is one of the best features of this house. Everything was custom made. So as we come through here, we come to a hallway with this really cool uh, tile work coming into the hallway. We do have French doors into the Jurassic Park room. Check this out. As soon as you walk in, can't you notice how cool this room is? We don't have wallpaper here. We have paint on the walls. Everything makes you feel like you're in the Jurassic bar somewhere with streams and stuff. And then we have our Jeep, the Jeep that's from the Jurassic Park movie, really cool wheels all with dirt on it. This is a bed. So you can sit and you can have this as a bed uh, for our kids that come here or adults that like Jurassic Park. Um, we do have a T-Rex coming out of the wall there. We'll show you that from a different angle around the other side. As we come through here, we do have AstroTurf on the floor as well as the carpet. So it gives you that really, like you really feel like you're in a forest here. And then for all the bad kids, you can put them in the Velociraptor electric cage bed. So they get one, two, three, four. There's four bunk beds here where you can sit. I think they like this. I like it as a kid, like it as an adult too. 
And of course, as I look up, they even have the ceiling with all the leaves coming out of the ceiling as well. Really makes you feel really involved in this room. Now, as I come over this direction, I have Haley go the other direction. You get a really good shot of this Jeep where we have the headlights and the indicators and also the fog lights on the top there as well. As we come over here, we do have a really good view of the golf course as well. So we have the T-Rex coming from the golf course. G-Rex has done really great. I mean, it is like movie quality with the details on it, the teeth and everything. And it's coming through the, through the wall, coming after the Jeep. So it's really cool. I think this is a really, really neat room. So follow me through the Jurassic Jungle. We'll go check out the bathroom that this room has, and then we'll go out to the balcony. So we go right here is the bathroom. It's one of the bigger bathrooms in the whole house. We have the water closet behind this door, and then we also have a shower. The shower has tile going all the way up to the ceiling, and then check out the cabinet area. The cabinet has this really nice cream uh, cabinets with this beautiful countertop and of course the mirror which goes all the way around in three different pieces all framed and we have the exact same mirror and setup on the other side as well and a makeup area in the center with a window and then a closet that has some really nice built-in so let's go ahead and check out the balcony and then the outdoor living area so follow me through this door instead of going through the sliding glass door we'll just go right out of the Jurassic Park room into the balcony. All right, so welcome out on the balcony. We have some really cool ceramic tile floors out here as well as I close the door behind me. Now, this isn't the only way out. We do have the sliding glass door that comes off of the media area and the upstairs dining area. But as you can see, this like currently set up for sitting out here and enjoying the Florida weather. I love the railing. I like how it curves and it curves and it looks over the golf course and also the pool. The pool is amazing. It is a beach entry pool with jacuzzi and also a tanning shelf right next to the jacuzzi. The pool also has some really neat water features like this waterfall and also these sprays of water that come over. A really cool look when you're out here enjoying the Florida weather. Right now I'm on the elevated portion with a couple lounge chairs with this amazing tropical landscaping all the way around. And of course I'm looking out on the Jack Nicholas golf course. I can see all the palm trees, sand traps and everything here on the sixth hole of the Jack Nicholas golf course. So let's go ahead and step back down. We have more lounge chairs all the way around this pool. Before we take you over here and show you the ping pong table and also the outdoor kitchen, let's go and show you the covered area first, which is right through here. So follow me this direction. We have the beautiful tile work, of course, all throughout the outdoor living, but this is the covered area. Plenty of space for dining outside, two dining tables, and of course a living area as well. And if I look up, we have the beautiful wood planking on the ceiling. And then we do have our sliding glass door going into the family room and also the French doors that go into the primary bedroom suite. So as I look over the other direction, if you're sitting in the living room area looking out, we do have an outdoor fireplace that is seen on both sides of this wall. Of course, the TV tile work going all the way up to the ceiling and plenty of entrances in. And all of these entrances have a retractable screen so you can put that up or down as needed. So let's go ahead and come this direction and show you the outdoor kitchen area, the summer kitchen. So it's just around this corner. We do have this bar area. The bar area is designed really nice. I like how it's designed because we have seats here looking out the pool if you want to look at the pool or we have seats here looking out on the golf course. So you have both decisions what to make. Very hard decision of like pool view or golf view. You have that both. So then we come over to the actual kitchen. The kitchen has a full size refrigerator, barbecue, vent going out, beautiful tile work going all the way up to the top of the ceiling. And then we also have a sink and faucet. And then we come out, we have our table tennis set so you can sit out here and enjoy some table tennis on your family reunion or business tri trip. And then we do have the other half bath is right here. So if you needed the half bath, you just step right up here. We even have porcelain tile in the half bath dark black cabinets, beautiful countertops, and of course the mirror, which is framed with a light fixture coming out. So everything you need here for a half bath. And then we walk back out and that will be the end of the tour. So I want to thank everyone for watching this tour. If you are interested in purchasing this house or renting this house, make sure you contact us at 407-487-3030. Get you in touch with Alice, who will be able to help you find your perfect vacation rental here in the reunion area. Thank you all for watching. Bye-bye.